just for you. Just sit back. There. <laughs> I'm... There. Okay. Greetings, everyone. Greetings, everybody. <laughs> and, and greetings, everyone. And welcome to another package opening. It looks like this is going to be a big one, so we might have to split it up into a few parts. Like three or four? Maybe. Already ten! Well, probably not ten. Who knows? Uh, we got... Oh, a giant one. A giant package from Frank. I think he's been working on this one for a while. And uh, just... I guess until he filled up the box, and well, it's very full and very heavy. I was actually at work when the package arrived, and I had to uh, go to the post office and pick it up. And the post office isn't that far away, but I had to carry it home. <laughs> it was very heavy. And so, this um, is like this. Yeah, so let's not uh, waste any time. Uh, it's probably going to take a couple, at least two or three parts to get through everything, just Are judging from the weight. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so yeah, so let's get right to it. New package from Frank. That's good. Yeah, what? New package from Frank. Today on the Multimedia Chronicles. I don't even know how to say that. Mary Machino Chronics. Oh. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. All right, Rose keeps trying to look into the cracks to see what's in there. So um, we're gonna move it over here just because the address is on the top and stuff. We probably won't be able to see it anyway, but that's just we're gonna slice this open here. Maybe at the top, then they won't be able to see it. Um, and there, and there. Maybe, maybe if we just cut open the whole box and then. Um, it would just be like, Actually, everything would be thrown all over the ground. That's and, right, yeah. Yeah, that would be weird. Hold on. Backing slip off. There we go. And we'll just, actually, we'll just take the address label off, then you can't see it. There. Done. And take that off, too. Alright, good. Can we see <laughs> Okay, can you move over a little bit, sweetie? I'll go here. I'll just take that one. Open. Okay. Ta da! Oh, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. I am afraid there's, there's more. There's I'm afraid notes. there's more Simpsons. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Uh, so we got a letter for me. So I'll do this later after Rosie goes to bed. We got a list of stuff for Rosie. Quite a massive list, holy moly. A whole bunch of stuff. Okay, so let's look at that. And questions for me. So I'll do that in, the, in another part as well. All right, here we go. I see. Okay, so let's start with, let's, uh, oh, we got a big bag of books here. We'll set the books aside, because I know because we're probably wanting to dive into the uh, movies. The movies here. Okay. Wow. I'll see what's on this side. Okay. Let's take yeah. a look. So just uh, go like one at a time there. Here. Uh, okay. We have Disney, The Great Mouse Detective. Awesome. You know, I've actually never seen this, and as you know, I'm a huge Sherlock Holmes fan. I've never seen that either. Yeah, that's something we can both uh, enjoy together. Awesome. Fantastic. I know that we both know this movie. Yeah. The Flintstones Christmas. Oh, there we go. A Flintstones Christmas Carol. Yeah, we've been watching a lot of the old Flintst Flint Flintstones Flintstones episodes on uh, Teletoon Retro. Actually, they re just recently had a man called Flintstone, the the spy movie, one that he did or that they did. It's pretty cool. I did not know what this is called. What do we got here? There's two, I think. We have. Oh, sweet. This is cool. This was actually one of my favorite Disney movies growing up. We have The Rescuers, 35th Anniversary Edition, and the sequel, The Rescuers Down Under. I didn't actually know they did a double feature uh, of that. That's very cool. From Disney Movie Rewards. Oh, yeah. That's right. You're in the Disney Movie Rewards Club, aren't you? Yeah. I tried to order some of the stuff uh, from them 
through their eBay site, but they don't ship to Canada, so I wasn't able to to get any. So what do you got there? What, what's what's that? Oh, sweet! Nice. We have the Smurfs season one and two volumes one and two. They split it into two volumes. So there you go. Oh, That's oh. the official releases oh of the first. You okay? <laughs> Did you get a paper cut? No, it's oh. just stuck to me. Oh, okay. And, um, and I also got a paper. So this is the complete first season of The Smurfs, another show that I watched a lot when I was a kid. What, city? Because of all the toys are mine. Uh, I don't know. We'll find out. All the toys are really at the bottom. Okay, well, we'll, the we'll get to those when we get to them. I, I have oh, no idea what that is called. <laughs> this or is, is, that is, this is kind of like The Smurfs Underwater. We have The Snorks, <laughs> the complete first season. That's the awesome. Snorks. The snorks, yeah. So it's like they have snorkels in their heads. That <laughs> is really odd. <laughs> Except the Smurfs, it's a snork. The snorks, that's right, yeah. This was, uh, I remember this came out basically when the Smurfs were at the height of their popularity. So, uh, you know, the Smurfs were made by Hanna Barbera, the Snorks were made by Hanna Barbera. I guess they're just looking for something similar that they could, you know, Use. cash in more on their own property. Let's see. Oh, what do we got there? Got some more, more stuff. Ooh. What's that one? Movie. Oh, cool! I've never actually seen this one. I've never seen it either. We have Balto and Balto Two. And Wolf also Quest. this Balto. Oh, <laughs> I didn't know they made that many. And we yeah. also have Balto Three. So uh, we got there's kind of Balto... stickers for something. Okay. We'll we'll put look that there. So Balto One, Two, and Three. That's awesome. I didn't actually know they did three of them. But, uh. Oh, God. Very cool. We'll definitely enjoy those. Holy moly. What I have there? no idea oh. what that is. Oh, I have been wanting to get this for so long. So I'm guessing both of us could watch that together? Oh, yeah, definitely. This is uh, Mighty Mouse, the New Adventures Complete Collection. I said it now, was Mini Mouse. So it's it's, it's Mighty Mouse. Actually, you've seen some of the old Mighty Mouse cartoons on one of your cartoon collection DVDs. But this is notable because this was actually put together by Ralph Bakshi, who... Uh, is most well known for his more adult animated films, um, but very twisted, kind of zany sense of humor and stuff. If you like Ren and Stimpy, you'd probably really like this version of Mighty Mouse. It's very, very uh, twisted. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. I'm definitely going to enjoy that. I've been wanting to get that for I ages. I know that both of us know this movie. Yeah? What do we got Tom here? Curry. Oh, hey, I think we saw the trailer for this on one of your other DVDs, didn't we? I think it was on my no. full one that has a lot of videos on right. it. Right. We have Tom and Jerry, a Nutcracker Tale. So we've got a few here that uh, we can enjoy at Christmas. We can put that with that pile. Oh, okay. We'll put it in there. <laughs> now, let's see. What else we got here? I picked up this pile. Oh. I already picked up a pile. Oh, oh you got a pile there already? I got a okay, pile. let's see. Let's see what you okay. got. Okay. <laughs> this is definitely for Christmas. Oh, here we go. Have yourself a goofy little Christmas. Now this is, uh, I see, actually, just without giving any way here, I see a few of these uh, exclusively available through the Disney Movie Rewards. You can also get them through their eBay page uh, if you live in the States or if you know somebody who can kind of act as a middleman for you. So you got Have Yourself a Goofy Little Christmas from the uh, Disney Movie Rewards. Very cool. And I'm the only one that knows this because yeah. I saw it on oh. <laughs> uh, 22. Did you? And there's one where he fell in... Pur um, pink or purple goop, purple and then goop. he just went back in time. <laughs> I used to watch this on uh, Teletoon when it was new. We have season one of Johnny Bravo. This is another just crazy, insane, absolutely hilarious show. This is. I love that movie. Yeah. it's really, it it's like... really funny. It's kind of like, kind of like a blonde Elvis guy. <laughs> he talks like Elvis and yeah, he's just, it's hard to describe. You just have to see it. It's hilarious. Oh, sweet. I have not seen this one. I've of course seen the old cartoons that this was inspired by. Uh, we have Duck Dodgers, the second season, season two. I'm assuming season one's probably in here somewhere too. 
But uh, yeah, so we got season two of Duck Dodgers. What are you doing? Grabbing more. Oh, you're grabbing more. There's just okay. one more left. So 13 episodes on two discs. That's that. awesome. I'd actually completely forgotten that they made a series out of that. That's something that. Uh, that I saw we'll one that was enjoy. kind of like that, except yeah. it was called Duck Dodgers, but um, it didn't have those guys, and oh, they're like okay. hanging off in the moon. Right. Yeah, they're hanging off the moon, kind of. Okay. Some toys are kind of in the in this area, but okay. Well, here, why don't we put this with that one there, and we'll do those two. There we go. Aha! Have you been waiting for those? And you know I've had my eye on these for a while and just keep putting them off and putting them off. I love how you, you send me a lot of the stuff that you know I've been putting off for ages. It's just like, I'm tired of waiting. Here, just have it. <laughs> So we have the complete series of Sonic Underground, which actually completes my Sonic the Hedgehog cartoon collection. Uh, well, I guess other than Sonic X and some of the newer stuff, but completes the 90s collection for sure. So I have the Sonic the Hedgehog, the complete series, Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. What are you doing? <laughs> you don't have to get everything at once. So now with Sonic Underground, which I've actually never seen, um, that completes the set. That's fantastic. I'll just put that there. there. All right, let's uh, just go through the pile there. Oh, nice. This is one I've wanted for a very long time. What is it? Uh, it's Opus and Bill in a wish for wings that work. This was uh, the one and only time we got an animated special, I believe, uh, based on Bloom County, which was a um, comic strip in the uh, in the eighties. Yeah, I guess eighties uh, and nineties. And it later became a, a Sunday strip only called Outland, which I'm not sure if it's still going, but uh, it went for quite a while as well. But I actually do have some of the collections of Outland and uh, uh, um, Bloom County, and I always really enjoyed them. Can that. we get started on the toys? O Opus the this. Penguin and Bill the Cat were the two main characters of Just that. stop! Rose, be nice. Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> Another one of those. Oh, and here we go to car carrying on from the the last set where you got us a whole bunch of the uh, all the Disney afternoon stuff uh, that was available in stores. Uh, since then, Disney Movie Rewards has continued a lot of those sets. Uh. This being one of them, we have the long-awaited Volume Three of Tailspin, which is great. Just just wait, uh. wait till we get through that big pile uh. of stuff you got in front of you there. So there you go. So finally, they're continuing the Disney afternoon shows with uh, with some uh, you know exclusive releases. Oh, here we go, and we have Goof Troop Volume Two, and I think over here, yes, we also have Volume One. <laughs> so we got Volumes One and Two of Goof Troop. There you go, which uh, has never been available in stores. Actually, this is a Disney Movie Rewards exclusive set. Uh, very cool, very cool. This is one that I know, again, that Rosie and I will enjoy. There's a grown-up movie in this pile. Okay, well, we'll get to that when we get to it. And what do we got here? Oh, yeah, I've seen these ones in Walmart. Uh, the So-and-So and Friends. We have Tweety Pie and Friends. So they, they've done a whole series of them. A lot of them are with uh, Warner Brothers characters like that. they got, even got a Batman and Friends and a Superman and Friends. Uh, basically just a best-of collection of cartoons featuring those characters. So very cool. So we got 80 minutes of Tweety cartoons, or no, 105 minutes of Tweety cartoons. It's funny, it says over 80 minutes, but then on the back it gives you the actual running time, it's 105. So almost two hours. Very cool. Oh, here we go. Now this truly completes the Sonic collection. We have Sonic Christmas Blast, which I think actually uh, isn't available on any of the other sets. It's like, just a, it's a special that uh, that we just, never got. Yeah, so. With all the other ones. As far as I know, I could be completely wrong on that. But anyway, nice to have it on its own. There we go. So getting quite a stack of Christmas specials. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Classic '80s sitcom here. I, I is used, that a grown-up movie? Well, no, it's it's a comedy show that was on in the '80s, oh. um, about a couple of roommates. But, uh, yeah, we have the complete first and second seasons of Perfect Strangers. And I think this is another one of those ones where, uh, much like Malcolm in the Middle and for a long time the Wonder Years, that we don't have any more of due to music rights oh, issues. Uh, WKRP in Cincinnati would be another one. Um, 
So at least we got the first two seasons. It'd be pretty cool to see those again. I've not, I probably haven't seen those since they were originally on, but that's uh, definitely a welcome addition we're doing to the. A new pile there. Okay, so that's definitely a uh, welcome addition to the um, uh, to the sitcom collection. Oh, this is a hilarious show. What is it? You're gonna love this one, uh, Rose. This is this is really funny. We have Courage, the Cowardly Dog, the complete first season. What the? <laughs> yeah, I've watched a few. I haven't seen a ton of that, but the handful of episodes I've seen were just hilarious. So um, I know that's one that we'll this both is really the enjoy together. Things he does for love. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. Read it. Yeah. It's hilarious. Do you want, you want me to read it? Yeah. There's the things he does for love. Welcome to the middle of nowhere, Kansas. Population, one kindly old lady, one crabby old man, and one timid dog, and all sorts of creepy creatures, scary monsters, and crazed villains. It's a living nightmare for poor Courage, who faces these unthinkable dangers with his body shaking and his tail between his legs. But Courage loves his sweet Muriel and grumpy Eustace. So he digs deep to find the strength to save his beloved family from deadly were-moles, dark shadows, and other sinister elements that pop up all over this terrifying town. With clever nods to classic horror films, this action-packed animated series keeps laughs and scares coming as Courage outwits evil with a singular brand of bravery. <gasps> Get your spook on with the 13 episodes of this two-disc complete season one collection. Oh, that's awesome. I, I, I'm definitely going to enjoy watching that. Oh, and here we go, another addition to the DuckTales collection. We have DuckTales the Movie, Treasure of the Lost Lamp. This one is, is definitely sought after. Um, generally considered to be a terrific family film, just a good old rollicking adventure, and uh, great for fans of, of the show and just of the characters. Um, oh, and this is one I know. I'll take this. Uh, uh, okay, hold on. All right, you got got them all there. Make sure they can't see them on the. <laughs> got to keep the surprise. Oh, this is great. Uh, this is one that uh, I'm gonna have to get a new case for this. Little busted up, but anyway, um, this is one that we were all waiting for for a very long time. We have Gargoyles season two, volume two, at long last, completing. The original Gargoyle series. Now the only one that we're waiting for is the Goliath Chronicles, which uh, is kind of up in the air right now. But now we got the whole Gargoyle series. That is fantastic. Yeah, this is one. This is actually one of the ones that I tried to order through their eBay page as soon as I heard that they had it available. But um, it's rattling around here. Oh, it's kind of yeah. It's just some of the. One of the pins inside that uh, snaps it shut, uh, busted, but well, that's okay. We can deal with that. All right, cool. So, what do you got there? Oh, this is another one I've been wanting for ages and just kept putting off, and now you've sent me. Thank you very much. We have uh, the complete series of Galaxy High School. That's funny. Now, I've always talked about what a big fan I am of it. It was kind of stuck that's to okay. this one. That's okay, sweetie. All right, just hold on. I always talk about what a big fan I am of uh, Adventures of the Galaxy Rangers. Now, you may wonder, what's the relation? Well, the first time I ever heard of Adventures of the Galaxy Rangers was in an issue of Starlog magazine, and in that same issue, they had a big article about Galaxy High School. So that was like the issue where I was introduced to all these cool up-and-coming cartoons that, in the end, hardly anybody ever heard of. Uh, Galaxy Rangers, finally saw years later, it was amazing. Galaxy High, I never actually got around to seeing. I've been wanting to see this ever since that issue of Starlog, and now thanks to you, Frank, I can finally check it out. Thank you very, very much. Definitely looking forward to that one. Oh, here we go. This is one of the, uh, I forget which one this is. This is their, uh, is this their first movie? I can't even remember. It's I Anyway, it's one of the theatrical movies. Of uh, the the Looney Tunes gang, we've Just got the Looney 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 Bugs Bunny movie. There you go. That is movie Looney. It rhymes. It almost rhymes. Yeah. Looney. So this is uh, this is one of the um, one of the earlier uh, movies. I, I can't remember when exactly this came out, and of course Warner Brothers doesn't put dates on anything, so you don't know. But uh, anyway, yes, always good. You can't go wrong with Looney Tunes. <laughs> 
Hey, speaking of which, we have... Tasmania Devil 1 and 2. Tasmania. We have Tasmania. I actually didn't even know Tasmania was out on DVD. You're, you're one up on me there, Frank. That's His awesome. His name is Tasmanian Devil. It's Tasmanian Devil, but the show is called Tasmania. Oh. So it's uh, it's a show featuring him. So we have uh, the complete first season spread across <laughs> two volumes. So uh, 26 episodes, I'm guessing, total. Something like that. Yeah, 13 each, 26 episodes. That's awesome. Fantastic. So this came out around the same time as like uh, Tiny Toons and Animaniacs and stuff like that. I know so much. Oh, there we go. I think we got another set there too, eh? Man, this is one that I have been wanting to get basically since it came out and again just kept putting it off and forgetting. We have Dinosaurs, the complete first and second seasons, and Dinosaurs, the complete third and fourth seasons. So this is the complete series of Dinosaurs. Not the mama! <laughs> Yes, I did that. Um, this is fantastic. This is basically from uh, Jim Henson Productions, who, of course, most of us know from the Muppets and Fraggle Rock and the Dark Crystal and all that stuff. Well, this is another one that they did. So, uh, great stuff. This is kind of like... It, it kind of reminded me of uh, the Flintstones, but if all the Flintstones characters were dinosaurs instead of, you know, humans. So, pretty cool. Kind of the idea being that dinosaurs evolved into a human-like society, but they're still dinosaurs. Oh, here we go. Speaking of first movies, we have... Hey there, it's Yogi Bear, his first feature-length theatrical I'm movie. I'm it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Rosie's digging into the toys there. Uh, so we got Yogi Bear's first theatrical movie. Yogi Bear was a show that I would watch every morning when I was a kid um, in my parents' room, because that's where the TV was. So we would... Um, so I would sneak in in the morning and say, can I watch cartoons? And my mom would be like, yes, just don't watch them too loud. So I would slowly inch the volume up to see how high I could make it before mom complained. <laughs> and uh, they had a block of the old Hanna-Barbera cartoons that they would show every morning. And uh, one of them was Yogi Bear, another one was uh, Huckleberry Hound. Those were the two big ones that I watched a lot when I was a little youngin. And here we got another one of Yogi Bear's uh, theatrical movies. We've got Yogi Bear's all-star comedy Christmas caper. There we go. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. So we got uh, another another Christmas movie and uh, Yogi Bear add to the coll collection. We'll probably we'll put all the Christmas ones together after. Oh, I see you want to have like an even stack. Ugh. Ugh. It's quite a pile of DVDs, holy Moses. Uh, then we got Bah Humduck, the uh, Looney Tunes Christmas original movie. I'm guessing this is uh, Daffy Duck as Ebenezer Scrooge. Yes, it is. Excellent. Oh, this is going to be hilarious. I'm definitely going to enjoy that one this Christmas. Oh, and here we go. I knew it had to be in here somewhere. We have the complete season one of Duck Dodgers. There we go. Now let's go through the books. <laughs> okay, well let's uh, let's take a break, sweetie, and we'll do the books in part two, because that was a lot of DVDs. So here's... Do I mean to count them? Here's one stack. Ugh. I'll bring the other stack. Careful. There we go. So we got one stack there. Uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, Hold on. Two stack. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I got I it. Put the pot <laughs> Oh, sorry. Ow. And there's the other stack. Holy guacamole. This is Batman. how light the thing is now. Okay. Yeah, I know. There was a lot, a lot so of movies in it's there. It's really all the DVDs fault. That's not too bad. Only one case got uh, got damaged. Everything else actually came in pretty, pretty amazing shape. Ah! All right. So we're going to take a break, and then we'll see you in part two and go through. Uh, we got quite a stack of books and stuff here to go through. So we're going to uh, check all those out in the next part. So we'll do books, well I guess books and toys, because we got uh, got some toys in here too, so we'll... Uh, How about part three is toys? Well, we'll do, we can probably squeeze the toys in as well, sweetie, because there's, there's not as many... Just look at all of them! I know, it's look crazy. Look just, just hold on, just wait, just, just, wait, just wait, just wait, just wait! I know, I can see it, just wait! <laughs> and also so, look at this! Alright, so we'll see you guys in part two. Ah. Until then, thanks for watching. And sayonara. And how many hours was that? A million.
<laughs> really? How many hours was that? I don't know. Probably like half an hour. <sighs> what is that? It's 25 minutes.